It was through Tucker that Carlton really got to know the two-time world boxing champion, Nigel Benn, the Dark Destroyer. We both friend had been picking out like that. Like that, no problem. And, and then you think to it, well, how long, how long did it be long before Carlton gets it? It's like half of him was gone missing. Half were joined at the hips. Colton and Tucker ran in security and became fixtures in the Ben camp. I went training up the Tenerife, they were there, and they actually done a running with me up Mount Tilly, so it was great to see them actually running with me, and um, they were there for me, not as like, you know, a lot of people want to, just wannabes want to hang around with you so they can get you in freebie this and freebie that. They wasn't there, they paid their way. I never gave them a penny, not one penny. Up to then, Life was like a big playground, everything was like a playground, That's a, and it was an adventure, you know, everything we did, it was for laugh, uh, or whatever, the reasons we'd, we'd done it, uh, and it, well, as I say, enjoyable, I suppose it was enjoyable, and then, but when something like this happens, for the first time in my life, it, it hit home, where what I was actually doing, and the people I was involved in, and the lifestyle I was leading. See you later, son. Is it watching me back, son? See you soon. Still very hard to accept. A lot of memories. You know, and I miss his friendship a lot. Obviously, this is the price you have to pay of living in this lifestyle, you know?